Good morning, good morning, y'all. What's up? It is me, Carla Marcel, your holistic transformation coach, and welcome back to my channel, y'all, where we talk healing, where we talk truth, and where we talk herb. Y'all, happy Monday morning. Just dropping a quick video to give you that Monday morning work, that Monday morning motivation, y'all. And I just want to say that we need to get ready. We need to get ready for a repositioning that is happening. We need to get ready for the anointing that God wants to put on us. You see, a lot of us have given up our power. We've given up our power to a spirit of defeat. We've given up our power to the spirit of complacency. We've given up our power to the spirit of disappointment. And now we don't know how to get back on course. We don't know how to get back on track. But God has been speaking in my spirit. And the breakthrough that we need is going to come when we worship. The breakthrough that we need is going to come when we turn our hearts back to God. The breakthrough that we need is going to come when we recognize that we are in identity crisis and we make a decision to get out of it, we make a decision to be bold in the calling that we are designed to carry out. You see, my call don't look like your call and your call don't look like my call. And we've got into this, this place where we need to compare and we want to compromise. We've gotten into this place where we don't understand how to be unique and be honest. We don't want to step on any toes. We don't want to we don't want to hurt any feelings. So we just got to be careful. We got to humble what we know we need to do. We want to do it on a smaller scale so we don't hurt any feelings. It's time, y'all. It's time to step up into the calling that God has designed you to do. It's time for you to step up into the calling that you are created to fulfill. There's an identity crisis going on. There's an identity crisis happening. You see, the world has this saying of build back better. Build back better. But the only thing is the building back better is deceit. The only thing is that the building back better is, is false that the world wants to portray. The world wants to portray the truth or excuse me, the world wants to portray the lies as truth. But God, he's repositioning us. He's re repositioning his people in a way where we will be built back better. Where we will be built back stronger. Where we will be built back right. If we allow it. This is a short video about truth, y'all. This is a short video about truth. And the truth is we need to recognize who we are, what we are, and the truth that we need to bring. The world has this thing where it wants to pervert our children. It wants to say homosexuality is right. It wants to say, um, you know, you don't have to do this and you don't have to do that. You just need to do this and you need to do that. But only except for the doing this and doing that is what's killing you. It's what's killing you. It's what was killing me. And now I recognize that I don't need to be killed. Now I recognize that I need to stand. And I can stand because I choose to not stand in my strength, but to stand in the strength of the Most High God. And when we get there collectively, the outpour that's going to happen in this earth 
is going to be amazing. Guess what? Something real is about to happen in this earth. Something real is about to happen in this earth. There's about to be a war. But guess what? The war at this time is not going to be led by earthly men. The war is going to be led by the heavenly, the heavenly host. And the heavenly host is going to use you to lead that war. It's going to lead you to bring people into truth. So listen, identity crisis is going on. I need for us to wake up. I need for us to snap out of it. Y'all, it's time. It's time. Get back on course. Get back on course. Get back into your calling. Get back into what you were designed to do. Get back into it. You gave up your vision for people. You gave up your vision for things that wasn't worth it. Get back into it. Y'all, happy Monday. Let's get it.